you know, it was quite different leaving corporate because when you're in corporate, if you need anything, you just call another department and they're able to help you. And so I didn't even know what the word networking was, Joe, because I, I didn't have to network. And so coming out, if you will, and starting my own business, I had to figure out who I was, who I wanted to be, how I wanted to show up. And I had to you know, shake a lot of hands and kiss a lot of babies to get established as a credible authority on the topic of customer service. And so it was slow in the beginning because I didn't know anybody, but I wound up getting, getting my first client within a week of declaring myself in business. And I wanted that easy button, you know, that Staples easy yeah, button, yeah, that was yeah. easy. And it wasn't easy, it just happened to be I was in the right place at the right time. So slowly over time, um, I've built up my, my presence and a lot of it has to do with being interviewed. A lot of it has to do with speaking. Um, we might have met that way initially where you might have seen me speak and ultimately wound up bringing me in to do some work in your firm and then giving me a platform at one of your breakfasts where you introduced me to um, you know, other business professionals. And so for me, speaking has been a very big uh, platform and opportunity for me to share my message. You know, I don't speak at a level of 20,000 feet. I talk like we're talking now, where it's all about how we're being made to feel as customers and clients, and it does seem to resonate with people.